In the last video, I showed you how to save the grab shortcut both to your dock and to the screen. So you want to make sure that if you deleted it like I did in the last video, you drag a shortcut to the screen so that you have it. I have temporarily turned off the automatic hide of my dock. That setting is in Systems Preferences under Dock, and what I turned off was the automatically hide and show the dock because I want to take a picture of it, and it's easier to do if I leave it open. The Grab application is screen capture software that's built into every Mac operating system, so I've selected it. It doesn't appear to be running, but if you look up at the top, you can see that Grab is actually running, and I have the option to capture. I can capture a selection, a window, a screen, or a timed screen. I'm simply going to capture a selection almost every time I use it for this class. So I'm going to choose selection, and I want to show that I have Grab in my taskbar. And then I can save that if I want, and I'm just going to call it task bar. And I'm going to save it to my desktop so it's easy to file, find. And then I'm going to take another image. So I'm going to select grab again. And I'm going to capture a selection. And I want to capture a selection where I show that it is on my desktop. And I can close that. I'm going to save that as desktop icon. Save it to my desktop. And then you'll see that I have these two images saved here. Now, what you're doing is your homework with your operating system project. So you should answer the steps, answer the first question, find programs, what's steps you take in your operating system to find a program. We did that in the last video. And the, here you're going to describe how we did these. And you're going to capture and paste those images here. So you can see they come in kind of large, so I'm going to just drag from the corner and resize them. But this will let me and I want to put some spaces in between these, so I'm just hitting the space bar. I can resize these so they're about the same size. And it's not a bad idea to hit save. Which is a little disk here, or you can do the keyboard shortcut of Command S if you're on a Mac, which will also save it. So this is capturing part of my screen as an image so that I can prove that I've done things. And we're going to do this continuously throughout this homework assignment. I will leave to you the steps on answering the questions, but this is how you do a screen capture using Grab, save it, and add it to your Word document.